Hello guys, welcome back to Start Up Hustle. My name is Kwame Chumisi. A lot of you guys request that I do a video on how to buy things from Dubai and ship to Ghana. So today we're going to look at how to buy cars from Dubai and ship to Ghana. And I'm also preparing another video on how to buy um, things like laptops, um, clothing, shoes, um, phones from Dubai and ship to Ghana. So please stick to the and I have this same tutorial in the Akan Key version. So if you prefer that, please click on the description section below to suit yourself. As we always do it, I've got a bit of um, like um, cost breakdown yeah, to show you um, so you have an idea of how much it's going to cost to buy a car, ship it and take care of And also I'll give you a sample of the duties. Yeah. Yeah. So if you want to buy a car and ship it to Ghana, I've got a bit of a cost breakdown here. We'll look, um, you'll, we will look into it and um, get into the end of this video. So please do not go anywhere. Watch till the end. Dubai, Dubai, Dubai. Who doesn't love Dubai? If you've been to Dubai, you can testify that Dubai is the nicest city. So Dubai is actually one of the seven um, independent states of the United Arab Emirates. It's a really, really, really nice country. Um, not country, sorry. It's a really, really nice city. Um, Dubai is actually known for its tourism, um, its real estate, um, its um, trade, and its finance. The the tallest um, skyscraper in the whole world is actually found in Dubai. That skyscraper is right here. So the um, the building you can see here is called the Burj Khalifa. This is the tallest building in the whole world, and this is found in the city of Dubai. Also, Dubai also got one of the busiest man-made ports, the biggest and the busiest man-made man -made ports in the whole of the Middle East. It's called Jebel Ali. Yes, so if you um, if you're someone that has already bought something from Dubai, then I can uh, reassure you that your container actually came from the Jebel Ali port in Dubai. If you want to buy things from Dubai, there's nothing wrong with it. A lot of people are trading, are buying things. People that go to Dubai do not just go for tour, they go to do business. So I can testify that one of the products you're wearing now is actually from Dubai. When it comes to cars, so Dubai got like um, one of the some of the powerful cars, like the most powerful, powerful cars in Dubai. Even their police drive expensive cars. Lamborghini, yes. Their police are even driving Lamborghini. So today, we'll look at how to buy cars and ship to Ghana. This video is brought to you by Fufufu Tech and Afro Arts Club. So if you want to design websites, Android and iOS app, social media app, um, website for your business, website for your church, website for your school, please contact Fufufu Tech and they will take care of you. They are young, talented Ghanaians that are doing amazing things. Yeah, this um, I also have Afro Arts Club. They are also young, talented Ghanaians that deals in digital art, pencil art, painting and abstract art. If you want to support this channel, then please give them a call so you can, um, you can have a service from them. What are we going to learn today? So basically today I'll take you through the tools and information that you basically need. Um, we'll go over the process. The process is very, very easy. If you've been following me on this channel, then you actually know that um, um, all the process about importation, importing things from other countries to Ghana are, are all similar. Yeah, so please stay with me. So today we'll go over the process. I'll also show you how to search on if you want to buy cars. I've got these three websites that I normally use. I'll show you those websites. I'll show you how to use them. And we'll also go through how to use a local agent. Yes, tried and tested local agent. And finally, we'll go through the cost breakdown. This video is going to be a really, really quick one. So please do not go anywhere. If today's the first time you come in on a startup hustle, Please show some love and click on that subscribe button, ring that notification bell so when we release any um, great content, you do not miss out. And again, if you love climate Trimacy, please support me. Yeah. Let's move on. So what are the tools that we will need today? So basically, if you want to search for cars in Dubai, you can basically go on these three websites. This 3M, so dubai.dabzil.com, um, UAE Yalamotoys.com, and Emirates Auction.com. So, three, um, these and um, three websites you can find cars 
um, on them actually the first two are basically for cars and property and the auction one is for any product you want to look for yeah but it's an auction site meaning you have to bid today we use anti some anti some company limited tried and tested so this is a Ghanaian um, a Ghanaian company but they are based in Dubai and basically they can buy and ship any product you want from Dubai to Ghana for you yeah tried and tested um, you also need your visa mastercard so if this are for those that wants to buy the car themselves yep and get the, this agent to ship it to ghana for them but if you don't have a visa and mastercard it's not compulsory you can actually get anti sam to look for the car ship it to ghana and all you have to do is to put the money into anti sam's ghana account in ghana so if you don't have a visa or mastercard you can still do this process and again we'll be using google chrome um, currency converter and google translator when we need it yeah let's continue okay so what are the process basically we have to process in doing this yeah we have to process in doing this so please listen attentively okay so for the process number one that will be if you want to do the search yourself and you want to buy the car yourself so what you basically do is um, you go on the websites that i showed you or if you have your own website you can go there look for the car buy it then send the details of the car to antisam company limited since you are not based in dubai these guys will actually go to the location of the car will take the car put it in a container ship it to ghana and within 30 to 40 days you receive your car as easy as that or you can also search for the car if you don't have a master visa card then send them the link of the car and antisam will actually go with a mechanic um, they'll, they'll check the car they'll buy the car for you you put the money of the buying and shipping into their bank account in ghana they'll ship the car to you within 30 to 40 days the car will arrive then you go for your car as easy as that that is process number one now process number two is also similar but this is basically you um letting um anti sam company limited do the whole thing for you so basically you whatsapp them and you told them that hey you want corolla x you want toyota vets you want toyota camry you want benz you want bentley yep then you tell them what sort of cars you're looking for okay so anti sam since they are based in dubai they've got connections with the local um, um trades car trading companies in dubai so they'll basically go there with a mechanic and go and search um, search through some of the cars um from their local dealers yeah and they'll send you videos and pictures on whatsapp with the prices then you get to select so once you select one or two um, the car that is suitable for you then they'll tell you to um deposit the buying and the shipping money into their bank account once they receive the money they'll buy the car um, and ship it to ghana for you so once the car reaches ghana after doing the duties then they'll tell you how much the duty is going to cost then you pay them then they'll deliver the car to your doorstep or you go for your car it's really easy and straightforward i've done all the hard work for you and to some company limited they are tried and tested yeah tested company that is shipping a lot of cars and a lot of products from dubai to ghana so you can straight away go to them and start dealing with them this is basically it as i told you guys it's really really easy okay now let's look at how to search for some of the cars on the website i showed you guys so i'll quickly go on um, chrome today we're just going we're just going quickly on it yeah no wasting time cry if you have any questions please comment below so we'll look at the first um, website which is the dubizzle.com okay so when you come here yeah they've got not just cars they've got like property for rent and other things like furniture mobiles and tablets and the rest but today we're just going to focus on cars yeah so we just click on here then we'll click on used cars for sale 
yeah i'm not going to waste a lot of time here normally when it gets to the search i want it to take your time browse yeah i know you go on the internet a lot and you do a lot of browsing so please browse yeah so you can basically look um, use here to search for the make on the car let's say if you want toyota make sure you select dubai yeah you select dubai because again um united arab emirates they've got seven states yeah so make sure um the city is dubai yeah motor is used cars you can select take your time and select anything here but um due to time factor let's quickly let's say we want um nissan okay yep so take your time and search through so this car for instance let's just click on the first one this is nissan nissan high okay all right so the price is aed um arab emirate dahir dahir okay so 44,000 44,900 um, eead okay this is actually a nice car okay so you can come down here yep and read more about the car yeah pickup truck they have four doors okay so the price is um, um 44,000 for a so let's look at the price of this in ghana cities so what i'll basically do is i'll come here then i go a e d to GHS um, Yep, to Ghana cities. Okay. So the price was forty-four thousand nine hundred. Okay, so to buy this car, you'll be looking at ninety-four thousand seventy-one and dot um, ninety-five pesos that's just the price of that car yeah remember we have to also look at um shipping and also when it gets to ghana the duties the duties yep so this is how much you'll be looking at in ghana cities yep so this is one way to search for cars yeah take your time and search through you can also search for other stuff like the mobile as i said mobiles and tablets and furniture and garden rents property and everything yeah let's look at the other website Oh, okay. So let's say, sorry, let's take a step backwards. So let's say if you prefer, if you want this car, what you have to do is basically copy this link. Then go on your WhatsApp. Yep. And send this link to um, Antisam um, Company Limited's WhatsApp. Yep. They'll go inspect the car for you. And if you want them to buy for you, you can transfer the money into their bank account. Yep, and they'll go purchase the car and ship it to Ghana for you as easy as that. Or you can actually deal with these people yourself. Yeah, pay them using your um, Visa or MasterCard. Then um, Antisam will go to the allocation, pick up the car and ship it to Ghana for you. When it gets to Ghana, too, they'll do the duty for you as easy as that. Let's look at the other website. So uh, the other one was um, Yala Motori. Yeah, all basically the same, guys. Yep. So again, you can search for cars here. Yeah? So we can go, let's say Toyota. Oh, actually, um, let's go to used cars. Yeah, I don't want to go like through this long, long process. So we'll go. Um, We want the minimum to be thousand AED and the maximum to be twenty thousand. Done. Okay, so it'll give us a range of cars. So this one is um Lexus, which is seventeen thousand five hundred AED. Actually, let's look at this. That's a nice car. Yep. Oh, but the mileage is 220,000. Yeah, and it's 2009, which is a bit is a bit too much. 
and it's white. Yeah, so take your time and read all the details. Yep. So if you prefer this car, so 17,500, let's go to our converter. 17,500. Yep, so you'll be looking at 28,869.91 pesos in Ghana cities. Yep, and this is just um, the amount for the car. Yeah, that's just the amount for the car. So again, if you prefer this car, you send the link to you um, and to some company limited they'll buy it for you and ship it to ghana for you or you can actually whatsapp and um, the seller on yala motors and deal with them directly then once you pay for it um they'll send the car um they'll give you the details for the location and some will go there buy the car ship it to ghana for you but if if you talk to me i'll say let anti sam do everything for you yeah because they are based in what you call it they are based in dubai they know the local market they'll be able to bargain for you because some of the cars on this website they're expensive you know and you cannot bargain since you are not in dubai you cannot bargain yeah so i always prefer once i get a trusted agent i always prefer them doing everything for me yeah so i can get my peace of mind so i prefer you using the process number two let them look for the car, go for mechanic, inspect and bargain on your behalf and bargain on your behalf. Now let's look at the, so take your time and search through here. Yeah? Take your time and search through. Let's look at the last one, the Emirates auction. So the, with the auction, the process is easy, but it's not that easy. It's easy, but it's not that easy. Yep. Let's quickly go on it. My internet is a bit slow today. Okay, so as you can see, yeah, it's in Arabic. So you have to go click either click on English here or click on US English here at the top. Yep, so this is an auction site. They basically have a lot of products, phones, laptops, shoes, anything you can think of, they've got it. So I'll basically go auction and I'll go the vehicles here. Yep, as you can see, they've got a lot of vehicles. They've got buses. Um, yeah, they've got a lot and lot and lot and lot. This is Toyota Camry 2001, that's too old. This is Lexus 2013. So the current bidding price is 5,700, as you can see here. Okay, so what is bidding? So bidding is basically, um, they give you a time. So when we look here, it's got time remaining in 12 hours, 2 minutes and 41 seconds. So this will end on the 7th of September 2021. Okay, so when they say bidding, it's basically they've got the products there, they've got, they've got the car there and they will allow all registered members to bid on it. Yeah, so when the time runs out, the user with the highest bid wins the car. That's basically it. It's like you going to the market and you are bargaining. Let's say if someone wants to buy a phone. Yeah, someone wants to buy this phone. Yep, and I'll be like, okay, and I've got like 10 people. So someone will say, I'll give you 100 cities. Other person will say, I'll give you 110, 120, 130. So I'll give like a time frame. Let's say I'm going to say, okay, I'm going to leave you guys for 30 minutes. Yep, so the person with the highest bid, if someone says 130 and the 30, <clears throat> sorry, if someone says 130 cities and the 30 minutes runs out and no one's um and no one bids higher than that 130 the person that uh, the person with the highest um, um amount wins so that's basically bidding bidding is basically everyone is giving out their own price yeah and as you can also see here they've got increments so if you want to bid now if you want if we want to get this um Lexix, um, 2013 which is currently at 5700 if i want to bid when i click on the bid yep i'm going to bid not less than 100 so this price will jump to 5800 if someone also wants to outbid me they also bid then this will go to 1900 so we'll be doing that for 12 hours one minute and 17 seconds and when the time runs out the person with the highest bidder wins this process is really good because when you're lucky and a lot of people are not bidding you'll be able to get a car for really really cheap yeah so again take your time and search through here they've got a lot of products but once you come here you have to register and with auction sites and um, they are like membership fees and when you win for the bidding too you have to pay 
like some sort of fees yeah so always the 18,000 you see here for this bus let's quickly click on it yeah that's the big bus you see the current price is 18,000 and the bid um, you still got 12 hours 12 hours on it yeah yeah you've got all the details here okay so this is the terms and condition of the bidding so please read here yet yeah, once you win the bid you have to pay 500 administ um, admin fee or if the bid exceeds 2000 and ad 300 otherwise okay yep so they've got terms and you've got five percent vat too buyer has to pay all the expenses related to document transfer to his name yep so you there are other fees too so you have to be careful yeah you have to be careful again um you can register and start bidding even if you don't want to bid just go there and and look at how people trade yeah this is a really really big auction site in the u AE. So to register, basically go here. And yes, if you're in Ghana, you can register. Yeah, so you put your full name, email address, the number. Yeah, if you're in Ghana, you can register. Ghana should be on here somewhere. Guys, nice, I'm a bit blind. So when you see Ghana, you stop me. Yeah. Yep, Ghana is here. Plus two, three, three. Put your phone number here. And you can register, you can create an account. Yeah, so you can just go on there and have fun with it. So that's basically the three websites that I know that are legit that you can buy um, what do you call it, cars or items from Dubai. Give it give the link to the agent, and then the agent will ship it to Ghana for you. If you know of any other Dubai websites, please um comment below with the link so we all help each other. Let's continue. Okay, so Antisam Company Limited, the alleged company, tried and tested, yeah? If you want to buy any products from Dubai to Ghana, they'll be able to do it for you. This is their WhatsApp number. So this is the number I actually used the first one. Yep, yeah, so the owner is called Kofi, Kofi T. Kofi T. Boabin, yeah, a really, really nice young guy, yeah? That is doing like amazing job. So just contact Antisam if you want to buy any products from Dubai to Ghana. Let's look at some of their products and um, they, they they actually did so just some of the cars yeah shipping to Ghana. Yeah, this is like the past that they shipped to Ghana recently. And they don't just ship cars as I said, yep, they ship products too. So that's one um, full 40 feet container and all this is for one client in Ghana, yeah? see people are working really hard so please contact them today okay so these are some of the um, products they ship to Ghana again so this product has reached Ghana as you can see we are we actually use this to cover some of the faces here because this is YouTube we don't want any um, trouble you know even caterpillars yes they can buy and ship it to Ghana for you. So please contact them today. And that's the products they were um, arranging in the container in the video I showed you to you guys earlier. Now let's look at what you guys and uh, most of you guys were waiting for. So the cost breakdown. Why do you want to buy a car to Ghana? So basically most of you guys would like to buy the car and use it for Uber, boat and taxi okay so i've got like a sample cost breakdown here i've done videos on how to buy from japan how to buy from usa how to buy from korea so if you want or if you want to watch all those videos um, i've got a link in the description section below i'll also leave this document in the description section below yeah so please go there and download if the download link is not working please comment below and i'll send you the link myself okay so let's say for toyota um vits four plugs um yeah, so um, a bit of disclaimer. So basically, all the prices I have here, they are not the final price. Every car will have a different price, yeah? 
yeah so the, the the price of the car will depend on how much they got it at auction it's also depend on the specs let's say the mileage on the car how neat the car is the year of the car either four plugs or three plugs so i normally give you this cost sense to give you an idea of how much it's going to cost i'm not saying when you go it's going to cost the exact same thing it might be a little bit cheaper and it might be a little bit expensive and also one factor to consider is down the dollar is at 6.0 as I'm recording this video. Yeah, so when the dollar is high, of course, um, things are going to be a bit expensive. But when the dollar comes slow, um, comes a bit down, then these prices will reduce a little bit. Yeah, so please consider this. Um, to buy Toyota Vets 2011 four plugs, purchase price, you've been looking around 20,100 in Dubai. Yes. Um, the shipping, the shipping is basically the same. Yeah. Yeah, the shipping price is now expensive, but the prices, um, this price will be legit. Yeah, it's not, it doesn't change that much. So the shipping price, you'll be looking at 5,700 to ship this Toyota um, Vest 4 plugs in a container to Ghana. Custom duties also um, varies, but if you like, you can get some for 8,000, 9,000, yeah? But with 2011 car, the average, you'll be looking around 9,000 um, cities. I've got the amount in dollars and in pounds here for those that are not based in Ghana. Now, the amazing thing is in Dubai, they can actually change the steer before it gets to Ghana. Just that it's a little bit expensive as compared to changing the steer in Ghana. Yeah. So when they change the steering in Dubai for you, it's around 3000 for 2011. Yeah. So around 3000 cities. So altogether to buy one um, Toyota Vets. 2011 four plugs you'll be looking around 37,800 this is just an estimate again it might be a little bit less but i don't want to give you like a cheap 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 estimate then you go and start fighting with the agents yeah that's why i try to always give you like the most expensive one yeah so this is the same for um toyota vets and um, three plugs yeah you'll be looking around 35,220 yeah Again, it's all the same, just that the purchase price, you'll be looking around 17,520 cities to buy from Dubai. Now, let's come to Toyota Vets um, 2010 four plugs. Again, the purchase price would be around 16,200. And as you can see, uh, the custom duties goes high. Yes, because this is older than 10 years. So when the car is older than 10 years, when it gets to the port, they will charge you. They will charge you. The last 2008 Toyota Vets um, we cleared from um, Tema. The duty was 13,000 just because it was 2008. Yeah, so the higher the year, the more you pay. Please consider that. And when they change the steering in Ghana, it's 2,400. Um, in Dubai, it's 2,400. But if you change this in what do you call it, you change the steering in, um, in Ghana. The maximum you'll be paying is around 1800 for fast service. Yep, and that'll reduce your price to 33700 But I know most of you guys would like to change their steering in Dubai. I'll leave this document in the description section below. Yep, again, goes for the three plugs, yeah? 33100 Now, Toyota Camry. So if you want Toyota Camry to you, if you're lucky, you can get it like at a very very cheaper price in dubai why because um in taxi most of the taxis in dubai they use toyota camrys yeah so if you are lucky you'll be able to get like a good bargain on a toyota camry from dubai because there's a lot of them yeah so again you'll be looking around um so purchase price for 2017 toyota camry you'll be looking around 36,000 cities if you're lucky a bit less yeah with the custom duties, I, I did not put anything here because it ranges. In Ghana, huh, you never have one straight custom. Like, let's say if you bring a car today and the duty is 16000 the next time you bring a car, it's going to be a bit more. Yeah, so it's not stable. So if you can, as you can see here, I've got it um, at the duty ranges from, the duties ranges from 16000 to 22500 So let's say if the duty is 16000 all you have to do is just enter 16,000 here. Oh, this is 1,600. Sorry, 16,000 here. Yeah, and the total price go to 61,000. Yeah, but I'm not going to put any amount here. 
yeah but the rate it ranges from sixteen thousand to twenty two thousand five hundred it shouldn't be more than twenty two thousand five hundred for toyota camry yep again i've got toyota camry 2015 here you're looking around thirty seven thousand but that's without a duty and again toyota camry 2013 here purchase price around twenty two thousand eight hundred yeah let's say if the duty is sixteen thousand you'll be looking around forty seven thousand eight hundred now let's say if you want to buy other cars yeah okay so these are the um the shipping just the shipping charges only this doesn't include the um the purchase price of the car and it also doesn't include the duties yeah so let's say you buy your own car in dubai and you want Antisam to just do the shipping for you yeah this is the estimates prices you'll be looking at so for a 4x4 car you'll be looking at 12,000 cities just to ship it for suv you'll be looking around 10,200 for a saloon car you'll be looking around 7,800 for a pickup car around 12,000 for a minivan a minivan or trotro yeah minibus van or trotro you'll be looking around 13,200 for a hatchback you'll be looking around 6,000 sorry about the dogs guy i've got this um neighbor that's got dogs always disturbing me yeah so you'll be, you'll be looking around six thousand so this is basically the cost breakdown yeah again i'll leave this document in the description section below and guess what we are done thank you so much for listening and um, this process is very seamless if you want to buy cars from um, dubai just contact anti sam company limited and they'll take care of you try it and tested they don't just deal in cars they deal with any products as long as the product is legal they will be able to buy ship and take care of the duties for you all you have to do is just pay them relax and receive your products in ghana hustle free hustle free if you want to watch um, how to buy cars from japan again you can click here or you can click there and i've got a description in the I've got the link in the description section below. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Kwame Chumisi. I'm going to bring you how to buy laptops and phones and other items from Dubai to Ghana in my next tutorial. Thank you and I'll see you next time. Again, please do not forget to subscribe. Yeah. Thank you and I love you guys. Bye.